Hey guys, welcome back to another Android Tips Auto videos. In this video, we are going to see how you can solve the most uh, common wireless network related problem that you may find in your Android devices like obtaining IP address, authenticating error, connecting message, or sometimes you even try to connect and it's not able to connect to, but uh, it just comes back here. So these are the problems related to any of the Android phones, whether it is a flagship device, Nexus device, or any other Android OM manufacturer devices. So let's go and take a look how you can solve all these problems so guys as you can see here i'm just going to show you guys here my uh, wi-fi setting what it is showing right now as you can see here right now my wireless is turned off and if i just put a setting here this is my wire it is disabled right now if i just go on there turn that on i see here a couple of these the first two are mine so if, as you can see we are getting this address here problem this opt-in ip address problem even if you try to connect to the second network so they both are have the same password here and somehow it was working and now i'm getting this authenticating problem and it just came back here and then it's showing a try to connect and it's not connecting so these kinds of problem hopefully you might find that if i just go and connect that again so there are a couple of ways to fix that first that uh, to fix up obtaining ip address problem you need to give a static ip address on your phone so that way you can solve and yeah, obtaining IP address problem and the problem like this uh, you see they are authenticating problem and try to connect as you can see it's connecting authenticating and it will came back after some time so this can be solved by manually deleting the already connected and stored by wireless network and try to connect that again so let me try to do that way here first first I'm going to solve this uh, obtaining IP address problem I'm just going to connect that and then clicking here click on the modify here you can see here right now so uh, just click on this uh, advanced option as you can see don't try to change the password because already it is stored and click on this uh, IP setting make it to static and uh, now type the IP address for example uh, this is uh, Nexus 6 so I am just going to type some sensible IP address so that I can remember that 192.168.1.60 uh, right 60 so and uh, now this is uh, come back here and the second is the gateway so gateway is always same uh, just change the last digit to one but like for example it is 60 it should be taking here one and uh, leave the prefix as it is dns1 should be as it is 8.8.1 or dns2 should be 8.8.2.4 so this is google public open dns address so there is no harm in using and obtaining that so it's same here next so now you come back here so as you can see just click save and uh, let it connect again if it is not we'll try to connect that again by turning off the wi-fi so now if i just turn off my wi-fi and try to turn this on and try to connect again clicking on save now you can see authenticating and it shows connected this is how you can solve this uh obtaining ip address problem by making the ip static now let's try to uh, solve other problem in which it shows you guys exactly the problem like uh, you know trying to connect authenticating and failing it's connecting authenticating but it's not able to connect it will simply come back so the solution to this problem is all you need to do is just uh, click on this network again and as you can see here you will see got option here uh, forget network modify network and you just uh, select this uh, forget network you need to delete that address whatever uh, configuration you have now just click again on this whatever uh, you're trying to connect so it will ask for the password so let me type the password just click to connect again So as you can see guys, we are able to connect our wireless network. We have solved the, all the problems obtaining IP address and authenticating, connecting and sometimes not trying to connect. You can easily solve that problem. So that's it for this video guys. If you find this video and this tip helpful, hit the thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe to watch more. This is Sarah behind the scene and thank you very much for watching. I'll talk to you very soon. Have a nice day ahead.